Busking for Gas Day 1. Busking for Gas Day 1. We are on the road, uh, leaving home, car, truly, as the song says, packed to the brim. Where are we going? We're going to stop the left and check the back. Snacks. We got a cargo full of snacks. Cargo full of snacks. Cargo full of snack. snacks. Snacks for us. Sealant. Snacks for pals. We got Puppo with us. The Puppo? Who got a Puppo? She's very uh, apprehensive. She has no idea what's happening. <laughs> she, she like will think that she's going uh, on a small trip until about an hour into driving when she'll finally settle down and, and go to sleep. Um, but we have about uh, 11 hours, 10, 10 and a half hours of driving to do today. We should be meeting up with two pals today. I'm excited. We're going to see Data Dominatrix and we're going to see Puppeteer. Um, Faithy, I had to call out because it is too snowy. It's snowing! <laughs> it's too snowy where, where she is. It is snowing in May and I am so confused. You're perishing. Caitlin's perishing. Our first stop on our trip, um, is of course uh, the obligatory uh, bagel, as well as dropping off all of the packages uh, for dice. So those of you who purchased dice in Kaylin's May sale, we're we're literally headed there right now to go and drop off all of these packages. So yeah. thank you for for participating in that. Yes, thank you. The dice are on their way. Fastest shipping in the West. Some of you, like Q, your dice might get there before you the see this video. <laughs> Actually. So I hope y'all are enjoying your dice. If you uh, have already received them. And if you haven't received them, then they're on their way. Cool. Well, that's that's the check-in for the morning. Um, we will check back in uh, either when something interesting happens or uh, we see data. Follow for more daily vlogs. But yeah, vlog, vlog numero uno. Of many. Of many. Of quite a few. We'll see y'all when we see y'all. Yeah. Bye. Bye. All right. Welcome to uh, gas stop number one. Uh, gas stop number one is brought to you by Arco. Uh, heaven bless. I think that we paid about five fifty for gas here. We're still in California, where it's likely to be more expensive than other parts of the world. But I'm interested to see how the gas prices change as we go along. So, thank you, Arco, for less than six dollars a gallon. But goddamn, California, your gas is it's just too expensive. This is way too, way too expensive. Uh, we got about two hours until we see uh, Data. Probably another five hours until we see. No, sorry, four hours until we see Puppeteer, and then another I don't know hour and a half, two hours after that until we get to our final resting place for the evening. Uh, but we're we're making it happen. We're getting there. It's fun. The road has been mostly clear. Only a little bit of traffic here and there. And of course, I mean, like, just like, look at the great plains that are like Central California. Getting to Central California, it is just kind of just kind of fantastic. Kind of fabulous. Uh, yeah. I guess I'll see you guys when we see data. The hum of the road underneath me. The bombs of potholes unfilled. Steer with my knee, come sleep next to me. It's my favorite place. The okay, so there was a slight, slight hiccup slash update to plan. Um, Data had to take care of some life things. So we are here to try out Data's recommendation. We're not going to show the restaurant for Doc's reasons. It's going to be good. Um, I got myself a strawberry boba. Strawberry milk tea. <laughs> Kaylin got herself a uh, mango. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna give those a try. We also got some uh, potato croquettes. Try not to show these off too much. Potato croquettes. Oh, they look so good. Croquettes are like they're like fried potato patties with stuff in them. Yeah. Kind like of. they could be like mixed with all sorts of things. Oh, so good. Fried potato. It's just another form chicken. of fried potato. It's like yeah. a potato pancake. Potato. Yeah. yeah I mean, croquettes is the whole thing. But right. Yeah. yeah. Um, and we got some. Uh, we got some popcorn chicken. So, cheers. You want to try the popcorn chicken first? Here you go. It's oh, so that's like the crack cocaine. That's so good. The like spice mixture. Mm -hmm. This is exactly like this place that we used to go to in Long Beach. Yeah, called Cha. Cha for tea. If you ever in Long Beach. So it must be a specific like, like a specific. Oh, dish. so strawberry eve. Very crispy. Very crispy. Very piping hot. My goodness. Yeah, it's fresh. It's super fresh. Super good. Mm, see if we can. 
Ooh, you can hear the flaking. Oh, can you see the steam? Ooh, veg. I'll give you a little half of that. It is. It's yeah. It's warm for sure. Caitlin's like, ow. Cheers. Ha. 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 My brother was telling us the other day that there's two types of people in the world. There's people when they have heat hot food. Mm -hmm. They spit it out. If it's like temperature. Too hot, yeah. And if it's too hot. And then there's the people that go. Hush, 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 hush. Oh, I'm definitely a hasha, hasha, hasha. Yeah, we are, we are the latter, 100% in this household. Snow just doesn't even do it, she just burns her insides. I'm just kidding, we don't give her hot food. We cool it down first. I did get us some ranch in case, like, they needed it. Mm. They don't. They don't. They don't need it. This is delicious. Um, thank you, Data. Data, we love you so much. Um... Sad that we missed you, but like, thank you for the recommendation on the boba and the snacks. This is gonna be perfect. But don't worry, your secret's safe with us. We didn't dox the place, so yeah, um, yeah. your secret gem can be uh, can remain yours. Secret. Yeah, the the lines will not be hella long. Um, next up is uh, we're headed up to the Sacramento area. Where we're gonna meet up with Puppeteer for some dinner. On a day, on a day like today. Oh, I. Am I up on a day like today? Oh, why, oh, why am I up today? Uh, so it's night now, um, and we have made it up to uh, Puppeteer and Layla, who hung out with us and had um, some food, and there's Kaylin, and then there's Snow as well. Um, we just had some food at Lazy Dog, and it was super cute. Uh, they brought Snow out a bowl of water and uh, we, we had a, a burger and some lettuce wraps and delicious food and wonderful conversation. Uh, so thanks thanks for inviting us here. Oh, thanks thank for having us. Water. Yeah. Woo. Because every day needs at least one thing, right? Starting off this trip strong. Every day needs one thing to be super interesting. This is the room that they gave Kayla and I right off the bat, you'll note the shower room is totally disassembled, but they've got fresh paint on the walls. So no showers for us in the morning, um, except that we did ask for a new room. And even though now we've had to move all of our stuff from one room all the way to a room, the very other side, and we've had to give up our king bed in exchange for two double beds, and now I have to go move the car. <laughs> you know, Kaylin and I are just always committed to making the best of it, so I'm sure that we'll do something silly. Like maybe we'll get an entire bed for a dog or something like that. Hey, Snowby, you want your own bed? Snowby, come here. Snowby, come here. Come on. Yeah. Or over here. You want to come over here? Come over here. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Yay. Lay down. Now that's what I call a dog bed. <laughs> uh, it's been a long day. We made it to hotel number one. Good morning. Oh, busking for gas tape too. And uh, despite all of the hotel kerfuffle last night, um, we actually slept quite well. Snow is loving having her own bed. Uh, we slept great. We brought our own pillows. So like, it's almost like sleeping at home, except in a smaller bed. Um, we are actually going to make it out of California today. We are headed the whole way up to Seattle. So we'll be going through Oregon today and Washington today. We're gonna meet up with a couple more pals. Um, along the way, all things, uh, if all things go the way that they should, um, and it's going to be a good day of driving a little bit shorter than yesterday. Yesterday was, uh, slated about 10 and a half hours of driving. Today's about eight and a half hours of driving, give or take. Um, and of course we'll be pausing for gas and things like that. You ready, Snowby? I think that's a yes. <laughs>
it's really pretty up here. We're out of California after a full day of driving. Let's go. Break, breaking news. <laughs> breaking news. Apparently, Portland is the like northernmost point of Oregon, and we are driving over a bridge right now, about to cross into Washington. We saw a sign that said Oregon, or thank you, Oregon thanks you, come back soon, or something. And I was like, wait a minute. Well, hang on a sec. <laughs> wait a minute. Entering Washington. Is <laughs> there we go. We're, we're entering Washington. Bye, Oregon. Bye, so nice. It was so good to be here. Um, heck. I uh, will see Eris soon. I, 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 uh, I am bye. What can you hear, love? What do you see? Feel on your skin when you reach out and touch. What? Can you smell? Does it have a taste? Remember what we do when it's too much. It's too much. And uh, in redacted Washington. <laughs> Not Oregon. No, absolutely not Oregon. <laughs> All right, day two. We made it. We're in, we're just outside of Seattle at the hotel. Wife and the dog on bed. About to get my ear some hot compress because it is acting up. Uh, see y'all in the morning. Good morning, day three of busking for gas. Got a pup in the car. We got the Kayla in the car, and this morning we're headed to Canada. That's it. Canada, international travel. <laughs> it should be a relatively short driving day. We should just be on the road for like two and a half hours ish. And uh, if border control is all sweet and nice to us and, and does well, um, then yeah, we should be we should be through with no consequence. That'd be really really nice. We would we are. This is the most anxious day, right? Because like driving in the U.S. is driving in the U.S. Yeah, it's once fine. it goes once it goes well once, then I will feel much better. Right? No, totally. Same. I'm right there with you. Um, I, really quick, there there has been some road drama. My conch piercing is looking rather angry. Um, it's very angry. So we'll see. We'll see what ends up happening with my conch piercing. I might end up having to take out my conch piercing. Like I can see this. I can see it on, like when I'm looking directly at Demo's ear, I can see it popping out of the back. Yeah, this, so the back is the worst part by far. It, is, it is a little bit painful and a little bit swollen and uh, we'll see how that all goes. It doesn't seem like infected, it's just like pissed. It's just, yeah, it's just angry for whatever like, reason. It's not, like pussy. Yeah, it's not leaking any kind of... Anyways, that is just... I just wanted to, like... Since that's probably going to be a part of this journey and a part of the story... Yeah, the conch might disappear. It might disappear. Suddenly, I might have to take it out, which would be a bummer after a year of having it. But um, but you gotta do what you gotta do for your body. Um, yeah, so we're gonna see Jam in a couple of hours. And uh, what kind of a transition should we do? Should we... Snap? Uh, Jam will be right... Here in three, two, one. Hey, we are in Jamland. Redacted. Bleep all of this out, Future Soup. Just bleep every single word. Perfect. Good. Thank you, Future Soup. Um, we uh, we made it. We're here at the BMB. We have a jam. Jam brought us some delicious bites to eat, uh, to have for lunch, and we are going to chill for a bit today. Um, relax, maybe do some practicing later. You insert shots of setup for singing and playing, and wow, this is incredible, so good. 
Um, but uh, we will catch you at the close of the day uh, because we're gonna mostly just take it easy today because tomorrow we will record First a song. Day. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Uh... your folks a book a beer that homey time of year la belle patate This is the this is the label from the place that we went to. So not not traditional yet, but here we go. What's in it? Birds in the breeze and the singing. And right, right, right. Oh, like the smoke meat one. The yeah, the smoke meat the, mm. the curds are different than I was expecting them to be texture wise. Mm. It's really nice. Place. I was expecting them to be more like chewy, squeaky, mm. and they're like more toothsome than that. I think. Hmm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yes. A little str totally, string, totally, totally. string cheese chew. Oh, so that is. <laughs> we don't know if it's hunger. We do be hungry. Or if it's poutine. But it, I think probably poutine, honestly. Okay, here we go. We're gonna, okay, we're gonna the other one. one. We have the traditional. Traditional. Yeah. So this is just fries and gravy. Reaction. Yeah. Must have been the one that they, yeah, the last they, one. Yeah, the last one too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, actually, to have it. That's the shit? That's shit. Oh, this is dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> this is bad. I think it even said in the play. Get it away from me. Like, morning. Might be, might be addictive. Oh, I will eat a poutine literally anywhere, anytime. You're like, I'm good. You just give it to anywhere? me. <laughs> anywhere? In a church? How about in a church? I'm thinking in a church, my friend. Yes. Oh, I'm so good. Hell yeah. Update. An update. We are on our way to our very first cake for cake Kaylin of the cake for Kaylin tour. I mean, of uh, the buskin for. I mean, the cake, the cake for, for Kaylin, Kaylin tour. tour. Hondo P. Uh, we're gonna be headed off to a cute little cake shop um, that Jam has chosen for us. Um, very excited to have some cake with some friends. And gelato. So we'll, and gelato. We heard that gelato. We're gonna is have like hella gelato. Here. I'm stoked. Um, so, because it is hot. We'll see y'all there. Goodbye.